Sunday, May 24th. It's about 2 o'clock in the afternoon now, and we're cruising east on I-84, headed over to I-90, and ultimately the North, uh, Pan Am yard over in Ayr, Massachusetts. And what we're doing today is we're going to be chasing Norfolk Southern Train 23K, and it will have the 8025, which is the Monongahela Heritage Unit trailing. So we're going to go check that out. And although it's trailing, I don't really have too much of a preference for trailing or leading when it comes to heritage units. And then it'll also be nice to get back out to District 3 again um, and chase something, chase something on the west end of the line past Deerfield Yard because it's been quite a while since we've done that. So that's what we're doing today. Should be there in about another hour from now. Unfortunately, air is about two hours from home for me. But it's been a while since I've been over that way, and there's a few good shots, a few good shots uh, close to air and Shirley, which I haven't gotten in a long time. So we'll see how we do with uh, 23K. Alright, so the chase is on. We just got the train over there at Wachusett Station, otherwise known as CPF 333. Now we're over here in Gardner at CPF 345, and uh, we're gonna keep going west with the 23K, with the 8025 behind. Continue on to Main Street, then the destination is on your right. All right, so it's coming up on about 6.30 now, and we're here in Miller's Falls. The two tracks on the right are the Pan Am main lines and a siding, and the one on the left is the New England Central Palmer Main between St. Albans, Vermont, Brattleboro, and ultimately Palmer, Mass. And uh, we're still chasing 23K.
right, so it's about 7.45 now, and that last shot we got of the 23K coming through East Deerfield was pretty cool, because if you look closely in the background, you'll notice that the office car special was parked back there in the yard, and then on the left, there were a couple of painted GEs also on the left, so it made for a nice, nice uh, shot there. Where we're headed now is Charlemont, and we put quite a bit of distance between myself and the train this time since I felt the need to stop for some dinner. So it's gonna be about, by the time we see the train, it will have been about an hour in between shots, but dinner is important too. After Charlemont, I'll probably head up to Zor and in the curve, and then probably the east portal of the Hussack Tunnel, and that'll probably be it for me. But anyway, we're still chasing 23K, with the 8025 behind. All right, so I think a little update is appropriate now. It's about 9.45 in the evening, and we're back in East Deerfield, and the last few shots have not been of 23K. Uh, we started chasing 22K now, which I forgot to mention earlier. I did know about it, but I just didn't think it would show up already. But as you've probably all noticed by now, it has the 4002 trailing, which is one of the 
conversion units, which has been painted in half, well, more than half gray, instead of the full black and white. And of course there's the 4000 and the 4001, which have blue noses with a yellow mane instead. And now we're just set up under this bridge next to Enterprise here. And uh, we'll see if we can do something with this bridge. It's going to be an interesting shot, I think. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see how it is. Alright everyone, I think that's going to wrap up our video for today. It's 10 o'clock now and we had a pretty good day with 23K and 22K. Obviously we mostly got stuff of the 23K with the 8025 trailing. And then we got uh, three shots of 22K with the 4002 trailing. So that was a pretty good extra bonus that I didn't think would quite pan out. Considering when things can happen on Pan Am. There's a lot of variables because it's a fairly slow railroad sometimes. But anyway guys, I'm not going to ramble on. Lately I've noticed I've been doing a lot of talking as I started to bring back this little vlogging style. So I'm trying to cut down on that. So we'll just cut right to the chase. Uh, it was a good day. Uh, find us on Facebook and Instagram. Links will be on the screen right after this. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and hit the bell. That way you'll get an email every time I put up a new video on the channel. And I guess that's about it. So like always everyone, I'm Aiden Nice, and I'll see you in the next one.